Good morning everybody. Please ignore the state of myself. It is currently about 6.25 a.m. I am about to go to a 6.45 a.m. spin class. Yeah, I know what you're thinking. Crazy, crazy girl. Um, I do spin classes when I'm not feeling as fit because I find them so good. 40 minutes, intense workout, you burn a ton of calories and I just feel like I can start my day properly after that. And I don't know if you, about you guys, but if you work out in the morning, it's really difficult to want to eat like bad or, you know, no food is bad, but more junk food. Um, it makes me want to eat a little bit healthier because I'm like, well, I've worked so hard, you know, <laughs> why would I ruin it? Um, but anyway, yeah. So I'm going to head to my spin class now. I can't really take you guys with me because... I'm still embarrassed at like filming in the gym. I'll try and get a couple of clips, but we'll see. Um, what else, what else, what else? I'm gonna take you today for a little bit of a day in my life. I probably should have started this with that, but it's, well, you'll know by the title. Oh God, this is chaotic. My brain at 6.30 in the morning is not with it. Um, yeah, I'm gonna take you for a bit of a day in my life. So I've got a spin class, I've got a photo shoot, I've got a ride. Um, I'm gonna go and see my friend. I might even pop into the office. It's a bit of a busy day. We'll see, but come along for the chaotic ride. This is a little glimpse of my new apartment. It's kind of messy, so I don't wanna show you guys the whole thing, but it's so cute. Ignore the mess. And I've, you know, I've not opened all the blinds yet because, well, it's 6.30 in the morning. I'm not gonna, but I thought everyone loves a little nosy and this is my apartment. Also, I'm going to wear this. I'm not wearing black heart because I left it all at the house, my family house, where everything is. I haven't even bought one pair of leggings back to my apartment yet, so honestly, I'm the worst. I don't know about anybody else either, but I really don't like tap water. Um, this is the bottle I had yesterday. I'm going to fill up my bottle. If anyone doesn't have these yet, they are the Black Heart uh, water flasks. I know that's a little subtle uh, push, but to be honest, even if it didn't have Black Heart branding on, these are the best flasks on the planet because they have a little straw and they keep your drink cold all day. I think it's like a comfort water bottle for me. I literally take it everywhere. And that's my phone. Look how cute my little thingy picture. You see, proof. Proof, I wasn't lying. It's actually, it's actually earlier than 6.30. Put my shoes on. Do, 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 do. Oh my god, why did I not undo the laser? This really hurts. Oh, ow. My ankle still kind of hurts from when I when I sprained it. It's it's better now, but kind of hurts to the touch and then at certain angles. This is my mirror, it gives me very nice side light. Also, I know people love seeing in people's fridges, and mine is literally a tragic, I live alone fridge. <laughs> Look, I have Diet Cokes, because I like to have one. Water, because like I said, I don't like tap water. I know I shouldn't be using bottles. I have got a filter. I'm trying to rectify that. I have one lone alcoholic beverage, some butter, milk for tea, because tea is life, some cheese. And yeah, well, okay, that's the second alcoholic beverage, but I don't like it, I don't know why I bought it. Tragedy. I need to trip down the stairs. So it's like the day after the hottest day of the year. It was like 38, 39 degrees yesterday. Don't get me wrong, I love the heat, but it was quite hard to do anything with. And obviously it was a Tuesday, it's not like it was a Saturday or Sunday. <laughs> Thank you, England. Um, oh, the temperature's beautiful this morning. I'm actually running a bit late, so I need to get on with it, but yeah. The one thing I love about driving at this time in the morning is there's literally nobody on the roads. So where's the time? I don't know if you guys can see. Got here with six minutes to spare. I am gonna go and slightly die on the, on the bike. I am a sweaty mess. That was like the longest 45 minutes of my existence. Um, you know it's bad when you look at your clock like, oh my God, how long have we got left? And you've been in there for five minutes. Um, 
normally I don't mind it so much, but today was was a killer. Um, good good class though. I feel like I've done something. I'm excited for my breakfast. Um, I don't know about you guys. There's something to me about when people just start singing along, and it's like, yep, yeah, have fun. I'm glad you're feeling jovial, but like when the instructor starts singing along to every single song, I just find it a little bit distracting. Um, maybe I'm being a Debbie Downer just because I'm really sweaty. So I'm having to rest you guys on my shelf because um, nothing else is the right height and I don't know where my tripod is. Woo. Just gonna have a little brekkie. I don't know why I said I'm gonna have a little brekkie and refer to my kettle, but I'm gonna have a cup of tea and some cereal. So yeah, spin class was good. I absolutely love it. Keeps me fit. Um, just feeling a little unhealthy at the moment. Need to get some veggies in. Look how cute my little So after this, I'm gonna go and do a photo shoot. So I need to shower, put some makeup on, get ready. So I'm gonna do a little photo shoot. This one's more for fun. My mum's been dying to do some pictures in the sunflower field near us. Can you even hear me with the kettle? I don't know. Anyway, yeah, she's been dying to do some pictures in the sunflower field, so we're gonna go and do some for sort of fun, but also might do some for Cobra, my swimwear brand. Um, after that, I'm gonna ride. My plan is to ride. I might take some TikToks, we'll see how it goes. Just need to, I might go for a hack, something really chill. I'm not in the mood for anything energetic today. And then I'm gonna go and drive and see my friend. You all know Ebby, I think. Um, she lives in Leeds, so that's a long way. Well, it's not that much, it's not that far, it's like an hour. Um, and like I said, I need to pop in the office, but yeah. Honestly, special case, like, so tasteless. I'm gonna put a little honey on, I think. Tell me this is not the best thing you've ever seen in your life. I feel like an old lady, but it just makes me so happy. Hello. How's my princess? Oh, there's Daisy. How's my other princess? completely forgot to film putting my makeup on but yeah look a damn sight better than I did earlier showered washed my hair full face of makeup so now I'm gonna go and take some pictures in the poppy field I'm wearing like this floaty black dress because I thought it matches like the inner bit of the flower oh my god what is that called I know what it's called but I can't remember um I hope it's pretty I hope I look pretty in the pictures I go through phases where I just hate pictures of myself because I see them so often that I'm like ugh that face again. So I hope I like these ones. So this is the sunflower field. We're allowed to walk down this bit. We're gonna go and start taking some pickies. Of course, this is my footwear, guys. So I didn't get to film any more of the photo shoot for you, because to be honest, it went really badly. So me and my mum, oh, my mum's incredible. She is a photographer for me in the business. She, it, like, we just do, we do a lot together. She's my absolute best friend. She does all the pictures. We work together, you know, uh, my horses are at home, so I see I see her a lot, like, it's quite full on. Um, so anyway, as, as a lot of people who work with family know, that when you're with them a lot, it does get a bit intense and you can bicker. So, although my mum is an absolutely incredible woman, we did start having a little bicker over which way the light was and how it was getting too bright, and anyway, it sort of fell out a bit. So cut the, <laughs> cut the uh, photo short, so I am in the dog house, um, not ideal to be quite honest, you can probably hold a grudge now for a little while, I'm hoping I can 
apologise for bickering. It's always hard in the moment because I'm quite a feisty character, so you bicker in the moment then you suffer for it after. Um, so I've just got changed. I'm just going to head and hack the horsies. I might try and double up and then I'm going to go and grovel. So I'll film a bit of the horses for you. I will not film the groveling, but pray for me. I've just finished riding. Nice weather today, actually. It wasn't too hot. It was a nice hack. I took a couple of clips on my phone because I forgot to take my camera with me. And to be honest, it's not super safe to be riding around with a camera on the horses just because in case they spook. There's um, the bailing in the next field as well, so I just thought keep it to a minimum. And also, you guys see what I'm doing horsey wise all the time, so hopefully, you didn't miss it too much. So, I'm gonna go talk to my mum and grovel and try and apologise now. See how that goes, I'll update you in a moment. And um, then I'm gonna go see my Ebony. That's Ebony for people who didn't know her full name. Am I fashion or am I fashion? This is a different colour, yes, these are my uh, yard crocs. So, Claire made me a sandwich. It's chicken with celery and a little bit of cheese. I added to the cheese and a couple of crisps, of course. So the chicken sandwich was a very good sign. We made up, I apologise. So we're actually gonna go and reshoot the, I keep saying poppy, I, they're sunflowers. Gonna go and shoot, reshoot the sunflowers now the sun's gone down a little bit. But let me show you what, we got a couple of salvageable pictures and they're actually quite cute. So let me show you them now. Look how cute this is with like a film edit and then and I really like this one because it looks like a bit of a book cover. I don't know if you guys can see the light very well. Outfit number two, hopefully this goes better. I don't know if anyone else is the same but I literally cannot travel light. Look how much stuff I brought. Oh, why is this not in focus? Oh my god, why is my face not in focus? That's so annoying. Oh, there we go. I have just got to Ebby's. That was the drive from hell. My own fault for setting off at rush hour, but ew, that took forever. However, just before I set off, I went to Super Drugs. So, to cheer myself up, and because you guys are nosy, let's do a little Super Drug haul. I don't know where I'm going to put you guys, or I'm in focus. I'll have to go here. Oh. Yeah, that works. So, I'm going on holiday soon and I needed some little bits and bobs. So, I got this. This is called the Fox Tan. It's, this, none of this is sponsored by the way, but if any of you want to sponsor me and give me free stuff or pay me, hit me up. Um, this is meant to be a tan accelerator and you're meant to put it on like a week before you go away, like every day. And it's meant to help the melanin. Melanin? I think. Um, and get you more tanned. I'm a bit scared of using it on the actual beach because I don't want to burn and I always wear SPF so I don't know whether you wear it under or over but I would definitely be wearing SPF as well. So anyway, I got two of those because this one was a shimmer one that my friend had and it was glittery and whilst it looked really pretty I didn't want to get glitter all over my sheets so I thought two of those. I got a hair mousse because I've been seeing them all on TikTok, you know, you see people go like this. And also, I get little baby hairs, get all fluffy. So I wanted to get this so when my hair's greasy and gross, I can like slick it back into a nice ponytail. I got lash glue. We nearly run out. It's gone all tacky. And literally yesterday, it was so strong and tacky that it ripped a few of my eyelashes off when I tried to take my lash off, which was awful. Um, I dropped some of it. Okay, I always use these little concealer things, this one's in particular, but I've seen people using it as like a highlight and a contour. So I got a dark one, a really light one for under my eyes, that one for contour, and then just normal because I needed it. I needed a new, oh, I've gone out of focus again, oh no. Oh well, you guys get the gist. I got a new uh, mascara, I really love this one, it makes my lashes incredibly long. And I also got one of these little, uh, like, thick liners, because I've seen that people use it as, like, highlighter. And then I've just obviously come to see Ebby, so I got her a little card saying, I'll leave you, um, because she's been having a really rough time. 
So I thought I'm just going to quickly write in her card and then go and give her a snuggle. So when I go inside, I will knock, knock, bitch. <laughs> Hey! <laughs> okay, we totally staged that because that knock would not have woken up anyone. But look, I got her sunflower and here. Thank you. Look at how big. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, throw it. Cute. Hello. Oh, oh. Gorgeous, gorgeous girl. Gorgeous, gorgeous girl. I did a mini apartment tour sort of of mine today, but look at Ebby's too. Oh, how I've homely been... this is looking. A little candle. I like a candle lighting. Give me a little pose. It's Work just... it, girl. Give us a twirl and smile for the runway. We use this right. <laughs> Heppy is giving me a tour of her kitchen. Oh my gosh, what is that's, that noise? That's my mum calling me. <laughs> I love how it's a danger sound. Have <laughs> a change. She got really sweaty. It's not even that warm in here, so I don't know why. Okay. Look how good this is. It's like ice cold. So, sorry, you were telling me about your rice. So, my rice. She's going to cook us proper rice, not packet rice. Not, not packet rice. Proper rice. Okay. So we have to clean it first. Oh, why? Mm -hmm. Why do you have to well, clean it? Because you wouldn't want dirty rice. Why would it be dirty? You want dirty rice. But I don't get why it would be oh, dirty. Woo! Just... Uh, yeah, so we need to go down here and just get our this doofa. This one? Doofa doofa. What's a doofa? It's just a thingy. <laughs> a thingy my bother. And then I need a cup. Bye. To measure out the Would you just bowls. estimate? No. Why do you use the best cup? That's a good cup. Because this is the cup that I used the very first time that I, I made this rice. So, you know, so you now know. I know I've got to use this. Holly and uh, Holly, Abby, introduce Dolly. your man friend. <laughs> <laughs> this is my man friend. <laughs> AKA. We live the together. Other AKA. In the voice. In Inhabit Inhabit In heaven? Why can't I say the right word? Co-inhabitant. Co-inhabitant. <laughs> the boy's face. Just dropping the halloumi. Oli. Oli Gomez, chef of the halloumi extraordinaire. Hi, Oli. Hello. We love men in the kitchen, don't we? Chicken rice, my favourite thing. Chicken yeah. rice salad halloumi. halloumi. And cheese. She knows I love cheese with my rice and my chicken. <laughs> It's kind of weird though. It's not it a weird thing, weird. To, is it? Do you think chicken rice with ch cheddar cheese grated on top is a bit weird? Uh, Have you tried maybe it? Maybe with rice. Have you tried it? No. Gomez's recipe for rice. Evie's rice was delicious. And it was rice. It was rice. But it was delicious. <laughs> Don't no, lie. <laughs> no, we'll get it. <laughs> no, but will you put it in some tough website for lunch tomorrow? I forgot my little, I forgot my holder thing. Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> Just got back from Ebony's. I just took my makeup off, had a really nice shower. I'm in my favorite oversized t shirt. I think it's like a triple XL males. I have a cup of tea and my favorite chocolates ever. I'm just gonna let myself have a little treat because it's been a busy day. Didn't get to go to the office today, but I do a lot of work from my phone, you know, a lot of content creation, a lot of emails, editing, et cetera, et cetera. So on a lot of the bits you guys didn't see, well, let's put it this way, I'm working 24 seven. So um, like work doesn't stop when you're in your own business. You kind of always are thinking about it. I don't know why my voice just disappeared when I said always. You're like always thinking about it. So like I just did some edits now and it's like 10 o'clock at night. So I think, it just never stops. But yes, it's been a, an interesting day, productive. Um, a little bit chaotic for you guys. I hope this footage wasn't too bad. I really hope you enjoyed a small insight to one of my days. For me, every day is completely different. So I could literally do one of these every day and keep you guys entertained. But I hope you enjoyed today. I'm gonna go to bed. I've got a busy day tomorrow. Uh, some of you may know I'm doing my helicopter pilot's license. so. I'm doing that first thing in the morning. I'm going flying. Um, got a f not got too many hours left, and then I'll be Captain Aaron Williams. Um, and then I'm going to ride, work, etc., etc., etc. So busy, busy, busy. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, please do like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.